New at 10 banking layoffs nationwide also hitting right here at home. Regions is cutting between 2 and 3 percent of its total workforce, some of whom work right here in Birmingham. Our Lauren Harkson live and on your side tonight with more of what's going into that decision. Lauren. That's right, Steve. Brittany, in recent months, several companies have announced layoffs coming. I've even reported about tech companies in our area making cuts, but now it's hit the banks and I'm told that fortunately it's not expected to be a widespread problem all across Birmingham. Now regions did send us a statement about the layoffs they're making, which says we consistently review our business models based on market demand and overall economic factors. This means a limited number of position reductions in certain divisions, including in our mortgage division, where the higher rate environment means fewer people are refinancing or applying for new home loans End quote. Now regions has about 20,000 associates associates nationwide. 3% of that would be around 600 people losing their job at the company. But we're told 70% of those impacted positions are outside the Birmingham Metro, meaning only around 180 people working at regions here in our area will get laid off. Now, I spoke with AJ O'Leary, the Birmingham Business Journal's finance and law reporter, who says Regis isn't the only one dealing with layoffs right now. Other banks, including Citigroup, PNC, Truist, and Wells Fargo, are cutting jobs too but there is good news. We could see some more layoffs in Birmingham in the year ahead, um, but I don't, I don't think there are any signs right now that it's, it's going to be a really bad year for jobs. I don't think there's, uh, there's no dark clouds on the horizon just yet. Now, though Regions is cutting jobs in some divisions, they say there are actually openings in other divisions, and they're encouraging anyone who might be uh, getting laid off to go ahead and look and see if they can apply for them. Live in Birmingham, Lauren Harkson, WBRC Fox 6 News, on your side.